Hey everyone and welcome back to my channel or welcome if you're new, I'm Anna Mae and today I'm going to be talking about my post-grad plans. So if you're new to my channel, I'm Anna Mae, uh, subscribe down below and I have just finished a three-year degree in politics and information and social computing. It was a three-year joint honours BA. So I finished what actually like reminded me to film this video is that I ordered a pennant. Oh, cute. I went to UCD. Yes, the logo says UCD, University College Dublin, Dublin, because logic. Um, but the that arriving in the post just kind of reminded me that I should maybe film a video like this to kind of explain why things are the way they are and just explain the whole situation to you. Uh, I might put this up on Instagram TV as well if I can like edit it, uh, if that's something that I'm able to do, but if not, welcome to my YouTube channel if you just follow me on Instagram. I have a lot more Instagram followers than I do subscribers here, so hello. So getting into it, I have just graduated. What am I doing now? That's a great question. So a couple of weeks, like three weeks after I finished my last exam, I went like a week after I went on a holiday with my family and then I came back and I started working in my local town. I work in a women's clothing boutique. Um, it is a real nice shop. I like where I work. It's great. But I'm not there permanently. I have been getting a lot of hours because when I was hired it was said that a lot of my hours like that I will be getting over like the course of my employment will be during the summer and we'll be covering people's holiday leave. So I've been working like 30 plus hours a week and yeah, it's been a lot, but it's been great. Um, but that is basically why I haven't been filming because if I get like two days off a week, it's pretty good. And when you do have two days off, because I have to like look nice and I'm on my feet for eight hours, uh, I don't always want to put on makeup and look nice. So I basically just wear like the ugliest, drabest clothes all day. Uh, so that's basically why I haven't been filming because I'm also super tired when I come home from work. Uh, that said, I have been uploading. If you haven't seen my work clothing haul or my work clothing lookbook, I think they'll be up here. Um, definitely check those out, especially the lookbook. It was not filmed cutely because I was just filming it in my room. Uh, but still, just some ideas if you're working in somewhere like that. So, moving on from there. So, so I'm working in that boutique until December. What's happening in December, you might ask? What's well, going to be relevant for a lot of content on this channel between now and then, most likely. There's still going to be the regular, like, style stuff and favourites videos and you know, occasionally a couple of vlogs actually. I'm considering doing Vlogmas because come the 27th of December, I am due to all going to plan move to the US for a year. And you might be like, what? How does that work? So it is a one year graduate visa and I believe it is a special agreement between the US and Irish governments. So it is like a type of J1, but it's a year. It's a one year internship visa. Yeah, Google it. There's a lot of like things that you can do and that you can't do and stuff like that. But I did not study abroad. That would have added an extra year to my degree. But I wanted to work abroad instead of do more school abroad because I didn't love school that much. So I decided to do that. The reason I'm not leaving until then is that I actually don't have a graduation ceremony until September. And then it would be weird to like, I'd kind of be bummed to miss that and then I'd be away at Christmas and stuff like that and I am going by myself. So yeah, basically I'm hoping to do a bit of content as to like not really why I decided because I feel like that's pretty self-explanatory. Um, but kind of going through the moving process and how I feel about it. And I know people are like, oh, it's only for a year. It is only for a year, but I think it is kind of different because I don't know for sure, but so I know that I cannot go with the intention of staying in the US after my visa uh, and seeking further employment, that's not allowed. I also know from a friend who knows someone who knows someone who's after saying that it's now a condition that I won't be able to gain a working visa 
for two to three years after I leave after this visa. So that's that. Uh, it's just that a lot of opportunities in the fields I'm in are there, but we're gonna figure it out. I might end up going to get a master's degree. I don't know. We'll just have to wait and see. So basically the plan from here is I have, I'm gonna be probably doing a video on how to take good ID pictures because I've had to do a lot of that. I have done all my stuff with CIEE and use it. I'm going through use it. Yes, I know it's expensive, but it's like easier. Um, I also did my DS160. Oh my God, I'm probably gonna do a video on that and see. I've kind of, after spending three and a half hours, almost four hours doing it, uh, I'm gonna maybe do a video on how I found I was able to get the site to work better for me because it seems that it's a common issue. Given that I'm leaving on the 27th of December, I feel like Vlogmas is probably a good idea. Maybe it's gonna be a bad idea. <laughs> being totally honest, probably gonna be emotional because I'll most likely be working a lot, probably working up until Christmas, being at home with my family and packing up and how I'm gonna move, I don't flip a no. I don't know if somebody's gonna come over with me and help me set up. If you're wondering like, the United States is a really big country, do you know where you're going? No, I actually don't. Um, I have a lot of family over there. I know a lot of people over there from college, like through dance things, so, I have a feeling it's probably going to be New York. I would prefer to be in DC or potentially Boston. I, I'm not like super dead set on one place and because I'm going by myself I have the option to choose. So uh, between now and then I also need to get my embassy appointment for my embassy interview but uh, that shouldn't be too difficult. I do need to like review a lot of stuff before I go into that but I just haven't been able to organize that because of work. So yeah, that is basically my postgrad update. Uh, I thought it would just be good to kind of fill you in on the situation. So definitely follow me on Instagram if you've made it this far. Congratulations, thank you. Um, but I think Instagram I kind of keep up to date a bit more on like forms and stuff like that. So definitely follow me there at anime.yt. It's always linked down below as well. And yeah, that is basically it. Um, maybe I'll do some more videos like this. I'm not filming in the same place as I typically am. This is a new photo wall. It's probably going to be on my Instagram um, that I just stuck up the other day. So thought I would film here because the rest of my room is real messy. So yeah, uh, I hope you enjoyed. If you have any questions and you're just like wondering about stuff, feel free to ask. I really don't know what I'm doing. Um, but yeah, so I'm just going to be, I didn't say, I'm going to be living at home, yeah, up until I leave, so. So, I finally have a plan for more content, so definitely subscribe to be seeing that as it goes up, um, and definitely follow me on Instagram, because I am so much more active there. So that is it for this week's video, I hope you enjoyed. If you did, give it a thumbs up or leave a comment down below, and I will see you in my next video.